2025 Rivian R1T and R1S. How would you configure yours? Hey there, EV fans. Welcome to EVpedia, your ultimate source for all things electric vehicles. If you're as pumped about EVs as we are, make sure to hit that subscribe button and join our electrifying community. You'll get the latest EV news, reviews, and tips straight to your feed. And hey, don't forget to like this video if you enjoy it. It's like giving our batteries a boost. Rivian gave its truck and SUV some big updates for the 2025 model year. Rivian just unveiled its updated 4 2025 R1T pickup truck and R1S SUV. Now, anybody in the market for a second-generation vehicle from the startup can configure one to their exact specifications online. How would you spec yours? Looking at the second-generation models from the outside, you'd be hard-pressed to find any major updates. That's because most of the changes Rivian brought to the R1 series are found under the skin. Entry-level models now use lithium iron phosphate, LFP, battery packs, for example, which should help the startup save on costs. There's also a new tri-motor variant, in addition to previously available dual and quad motor options. The electrical architecture is all new as well. For more details on all that, you can read our deep dive into the updates to the R1 or our first drive review of the new models. Now, onto what we see in Rivian's online configurator. The 2025 R1S and R1T are each available in four flavors for now, depending on the battery size and number of motors you choose. There's dual standard, dual large, dual max, and tri-max. Right now, quad motor variants don't appear online. The 2025 R1S retails for $75,900 to start, while the R1T starts at $69,900. Rivian's introduced some new options for the 2025 models as well. Funky-looking 22-inch, range-optimizing wheels will run you $1,000 to $2,000, depending on the trim level you choose. A dark-out package, which blacks out your Rivian's shiny trim and badging, costs $1,000 on the R1S and $750 on the R1T, unless you get a Tri-Max vehicle, in which case that package is standard. A dynamic glass roof, which can turn opaque at the press of a button, costs $1,500 on vehicles that offer it. It's unavailable for entry-level Rivians and comes standard on Tri-Max variants. As for me, I'd be thrilled with a Rivian R1 SSN Tri-Max in Rivian Blue with dark 22-inch sport wheels and the brown ash wood interior. That also includes a lot of nice options as well. The only downside, I suppose, is that it'd run about $109,400. And do I really need to do 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.9 seconds? I'll have to think on it. How would you spec your 2025 Rivian R1S or R1T? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for tuning in to EVpedia. If you had as much fun as we did, leave us a comment below and tell us your favorite electric vehicle moment. And remember, hitting that subscribe button is the best way to keep the EV vibes flowing. Until next time, stay charged and keep those wheels spinning.